Welcome to Tally Help Videos. In this video, you will learn how to save view for a report with contextual settings, such as with specific masters, period, and comparison of data for multiple companies. The first scenario is saving a view with the selected master. Consider that you are a production manager and track a set of raw materials regularly to take action accordingly to the stock availability. In such a case, it will be convenient if you save the view with those items in the stock group summary. So whenever you need the report, you can use the saved view. Let us see how to do it. Open stock group summary in Tally Prime. Press Alt-G, type or select stock group summary and press enter. The stock group summary appears. Click stock group or press F4. Select the required group and press Enter. Now, press F12 and set Show Goods Inwards, Show Goods Outwards, and Show Closing Balance to Yes. As you can see, the columns for Inwards, Outwards, and Closing Balance have appeared in the report. Now, let us save this view. Click Save View or Control L. Let us call it Stock Group Summary for Raw Materials. Set Show Additional Configuration as Yes. Let us save this view for this company, which will enable your production supervisors to access the saved view and take necessary actions. Set Save with the master selected to open the report to Yes. Henceforth, every time you open the saved view, it will open for the selected stock group. Press Ctrl A to save and close the report. Now, press Alt G. As you can see, all the saved views are listed. Type or select Stock Group Summary for Raw Materials and press Enter. The report opens for the stock group for raw materials that we had selected, and it will be displayed as per the latest data. Now, let us see how to save view for a report in a specific period. Suppose you are an auditor who frequently audits balance sheets in a detailed format with working capital for a specific month. In such a case, you can save a view for balance sheet with the report period. Let us see how to do it. Open Balance Sheet. Press Alt-G, type or select Balance Sheet, and press Enter. Let us set the period as May 2021. Press F2. Enter the from and to dates. You can now view Balance Sheet for May 2021. Now, press F12, set Format of Report as detailed, and press Ctrl A to save. Click Basis of Values or press Ctrl B. Under List of Configurations, select Include Working Capital and press Enter. Press Ctrl A to save. Click Save View or press Ctrl L. Let us name it Balance Sheet for May with Working Capital. Set Show Additional Configuration to Yes. Now, set Save with the selected period to Yes. Subsequently, whenever you will open Balance Sheet with this view, it will open for May 2021. Press Enter and then press Y to accept. Now, press Alt-G, type or select Balance Sheet for May with Working Capital and press Enter. Balance Sheet opens with the selected view for May 2021. Now let us see how to save a view for a report with multiple columns for different companies or branches. You may want to view Profit and Loss Account Report for multiple branches of your company to assess the business. To do so, it is imperative that you load all the companies in Tally Prime. After loading the companies, press Alt-G, type or select Profit and Loss Account, and press Enter. 
Now click New Column or simply press Alt-C to add companies. The Column Details screen appears. Under Name of Company, select the company. Enter the from and to dates as applicable. Then enter currency if needed. Select method of stock valuation and type of value to show as per your requirement. For this instance, let us select default and actuals under the respective options. Press Ctrl A to save. Similarly, you can add more columns for other branches. After adding the columns, you can compare the business in the selected branches. Now, save this view. Click Save View or press Ctrl L. Let's name it Comparative Study of All the Branches. You need to save this view for all companies on this computer as it involves multiple companies. Press Ctrl A to save and close the report. Now, press Alt G, type or select Comparative Study of All the Branches and press Enter. Profit and Loss Account appears with the respective columns for all the three companies provided the companies used in this report are loaded. As you saw, you can save a view for a report with a range of contextual settings and then seamlessly navigate the view using GoTo. This will help you save the scenario-based settings and configuration in a report and then access the view in a matter of seconds whenever required. Thank you. To learn more about Tally Prime features, visit help.tallysolutions.com.